Hello, I'm Bob Mankoff, cartoon editor of the New Yorker magazine, and welcome to a Let's Go Mets episode of the Cartoon Lounge. So why am I wearing a Yankee cap? Well, as everybody knows, I am a Yankee fan. I was born in the Bronx. But today, all New Yorkers are Mets fans. So originally the Mets were not a great team. In 1962, they were just created and they couldn't get the best players. Casey Stengel was the manager of the Mets that year and he was actually known as a Yankee manager and he's got a tough job on his hand and this cartoon from 1962 shows that. Shrink is saying to the patient, suppose you just tell me your troubles, not Casey Stengel's. And his troubles are, of course, the Met players. Here in a cartoon two years later, they still got that troubles. Here's all the Mets in the dugout. And this kid is saying, gee, we sure play against a lot of swell teams. And a lot of those swell teams were very happy to play against the Mets. So they lost lots and lots of games. But eventually the Mets become a pretty swell team. In 1986, they have a really good team. They win the World Series. This is a cartoon of that year when they're in the World Series by Al Ross. His last words were, let's go Mets. 2000, they play the Yankees. Uh, in the Subway Series. George Price cartoon on that. Why anyone should look forward to a Subway Series is beyond me. The subway is too crowded. And to this day, it's still, are you a Mets fan or a Yankees fan? And this cartoon illustrates that. Maitre D saying Mets or Yankees. But like I said at the beginning, we're all Mets fans today. Let's go Mets! Today's Ask Bob is from Rabbi Jeffrey Sachs. He asks, okay, I understand why there are so many cat and dog cartoons. That means you understand more than me, but okay. But what's with the lemmings? Why do they show up in New Yorker cartoons so frequently? Well, I'm certainly guilty of that. I did this cartoon. And if you will look at the Talmud, Rabbi, you will see that there is in fact no tractate on lemmings. And yet, I think there could be, because what do lemmings represent? They represent the triumph of belief over experience, just like second marriages do.